What's up, everybody? It's Carlos Simmons, also known as Agato, and today we're back with a reaction, a uh, different show. I'm I'm starting to try to just do different shows. Uh, you know, uh, if I'm only watching One Piece, I'm just not gonna watch it. It just burns me out too much of the show, uh, and I wanna I, just, I like other things nowadays. Anyways, so I've been hearing everybody talk about Arcane. People nonstop talk about it been seeing people cosplay it and i don't know what the hell this show is about at all like i got zero zero knowledge so decided to give it a shot to see what happens well i mean what's the worst that can happen that i don't like the first episode right but um i've been hearing a lot of people say that's amazing that one could even say that it's peak uh so we're gonna give it a shot a fair shot uh i'm gonna give it what I always do with most shows, three to five episodes, and we'll see what happens. But hopefully, I like it enough that I actually watch the full nine episodes. I did see how long it is, and nine episodes isn't that really isn't all that long. So hopefully, it's good. Hopefully, you guys enjoy the reaction. Um, we're gonna start with episode one of season one. Yeah. With that being said, oh yeah. Uh, as always, follow me on all my socials at Carlos Simmons. It'll mean a whole lot to me. Uh, but with all that being said, let's just get into it, huh? I already like how it starts with the whole song. Oh, this already feels so ominous, and I'm loving that. How does the show off rip start to so ominous? And it's also called Welcome to the Playground, and it just, it's like this? This is how it starts? If this is the vibe for the show, I think I'm gonna really like this. I'm gonna like this a whole lot. Yeah. This vibe? I'm messing with this vibe. Holy shit! What the fuck is going on here? I usually don't like this type of animation, but like I said, I'm gonna give it a shot. Or the art style, better said. The music, the way things look, everything is just giving this real emotional vibe. Like, you can feel a lot of it. And I'm already starting to really like that. I'm starting to like that a lot already off rip. Oh, who's that? Who are those people? I guess those are her pa the, their parents. This is such an amazing start. That's a lot of anger in her eyes. Damn, everything looks so pretty here. Honestly, I like that guy already. I don't know anything about him. But the one that said I'm gonna shoot that thing down, I, I like that guy. I don't know, I just like his vibe. I, I definitely hope that I like a character enough in the series to make me cosplay him. Because I've seen a lot of people cosplay them. And I just, I, I wanna, I really do wanna cosplay someone. Even though I know nothing of League of Legends, so. Oh, she ballsy, huh? And I'm guessing she's the leader. Come on, you can do this. Come on, you got this. Who's Vander? Who's Vander and what's really going on here? Like, why are these people acting the way they are? Like, I guess they come from a poor place or something. I'm, I'm guessing that's what it is. But who's Vander and who's each each one of these people? And what do they all do? Ugh, who locks their balcony? Oh, so he's like a row of thief. Okay, that's cool. Oh, damn. Okay. I mean, that's one way to get in. Again, I really don't know much about the dude... That guy in the back who was just trying to pick a lock. But I really like him. I really like him. I like his character. But why is she so aggressive? Why is the girl with the pink hair so aggressive? He just knocked that door down. He was trying to be all sneaky and everything. What are they stealing right now? Just toys or gadgets or what? Oh, so that's Milo. Okay, that's his name. Milo the Rogue. What do you find? What's that? What's in there? So I'm really interested in the world of Arcane. Like, what's going on here? I'm guessing we're in the kind of like the future. It also gives me, um, ah, uh, God, I think it's Lost Planet. No, Treasure Planet vibes. The arts, the way everything looks gives me very much Treasure Planet vibes, which I'm all for. I actually really love that movie. So I think I'm going to like this a lot. What's all that? Oh, something's about to happen. Oh, damn. That's not good. What is that? What is about to happen? Something bad is about to happen. What is going on? Oh, this is just never good in any show. Uh oh, that's not good. That's one giant explosion. So I wonder if they're gonna get caught or how they're gonna escape out of this. Oh, bye Milo. I mean, that's one way to get out. Oh, they already know what's going on. Guessing he's like the tank. Yeah, y'all set yourself up for this though. Like, if y'all didn't 
if she wouldn't have messed up like that, if she would have just stayed calm and picked up the treasure like she was supposed to and get out of there and not cause a whole explosion, things would have been fine. I understand the guy got there and, you know, things like that are about to happen. Or the owner of the purse, or the owner of the apartment, whatever they went to, was got there, so that was a problem. But it is kind of your fault. Also, I think this dude's a tank, or like a tank character. He's a fighter, I'm guessing. The other person's a rogue. I'm guessing the girl with the blue hair is gonna be like a wizard or something. Ooh, let's go! Oh, that just looks like it hurts. Oh, no. She got. She got rocked hard right there. Oh. Ooh. Oh, let's go, Milo. Hey, you better run now. Let's go, Milo. Come on, you got this. I like how they fight dirty, too. How everyone does. This man really pulls out a knife on her. And she just says, you won't really want to see how that ends. She has no fear whatsoever. That is a badass right there. You got, you got to applaud that type of bravery. God damn. Nah, you got to stop babying powder. You gotta take a fucking. You just... gotta take some accountability. No. All right, something that this show is already doing super well is just the way things look, and the music as well. It just makes it just makes it so great. It makes it just amazing. So I'm I'm really liking that. I'm loving the vibes of this show. I'm not loving that vibe. Oh, everyone's mad now. So that's Vander. Okay, so we finally meet Vander, the person that they talked about already before. Yeah, you don't want to mess with... I mean, he seems like he's a guy that you don't want to mess with. He also seems like a good stand-up guy, so... Let's see what happens. Hound of the Underground. That's a hell of a name. He just says, I'll let you walk out of here if if you comply, basically. Like, if you do what I say, you will get out of here. That's just a cold, cold man. So I'm guessing he's a father figure for her, and he's the one that saved her, and also Powder. But I wonder what's gonna happen. Like she's about to get lectured. He's really looking after her though. Like he really is. So why does he baby her but treat them like shit? Oh, she kept one of the things. Now I feel bad for Powder. Milo did mess up. I'm really liking her too. So their tip was him. I like him. He he's real spunky. He's got a lot of energy. He's cool. He's cool. Why do they put on the mask? Is it like, do they put on the mask for a certain reason? The gas mask? Is it like toxic to breathe in here or are they just already catching some type of cold or sickness or something? Or what's going on with that? So things got real tricky. How much pull does Vander have? And they're definitely going to use him as an example if he's the one that's making these deals to protect everyone. But that's just all crazy. Being powder. Okay, so. Yeah. God damn. B, you done fucked up. Definitely show Vander. I mean, I think those things are going to give them their powers. If they get powers, I don't know how, again, how this whole universe works. But you should, yeah, you should definitely show Vander. You should definitely show Vander what's going on. You, the, what you're doing right now, it's, it's uh, not so good. Not so good. Not the smart idea. Who is this? What is going on over here? Oh, okay. I'm really liking how this story is unfolding. Oh, that, that rat is going crazy. Bye-bye, cat. Holy shit. So this is wild. I'm really looking forward to the rest of it. I'm gonna watch this show for sure, for sure. Oh, they're gonna give that to that other kid. 